Whatever. But no, no, so we're walking down the street. I forgot about yeah, that. Yeah, this right. is the big one. Yeah. So we're walking down the street. And a guy, t- someone had given you at your spot. Somebody gave me a book at the brunch show at the stand. And it's a book. The it's Red on, Dawn or some shit. Some book about whatever. It's yeah. A, it's a political thriller, but it's true. It's fi- oh, nonfiction. Yeah, whatever. yeah whatever. So this guy, we're walking down. And like he, and he, and he kind of brushes past him. And he goes, and he like sees the book. He goes, oh, what you reading here? And uh, like a young guy, like, you know, 30, guys in their 30s. Like, what you reading there? And you're like, oh, someone gave it to me. And he looks at the cover. And I don't know if it's reflective of the book. He goes, oh, it's like a David Goliath story. Did David win? And like, we're like, what? Like, and then he's like, uh, maybe you should call me and uh, let me know he what happened. You want to text me the title? Yeah. And I was so thrown off. I didn't even know. If, I didn't think the guy was trying to fuck me. I was so thrown off because I'm so on guard for like an old school grift. Right. Smash and grab. Grab the wallet. Sure. Grab my phone. I take my phone out. He grabs my phone, starts running. Now I got to chase this guy down. Maybe he's a good runner. Right. What am I going to do? Better run, either way, he's a better runner than you. And you. Oh, right. I mean, so, I used to run five miles a day. What about now? Not so much. You're going to chase? No, we're not chasing that. No. So I'm like, um, you could just put the... And then he gave me this long, longing, weird look. Yeah. Like he wanted to fuck. But what's weird is like, he didn't even see my face when he stopped me. What's the thing? Yeah, he, he starts it from behind. And, uh, and I don't present this gay, except you said I have a little bit of a gay walk. Occasionally. So from the back, do you think he said, that guy's, I'm a weird cell from the back. Yeah. If he's just watching me walk down a street, that's why you want to fuck me? You don't even have a fat ass. No, I got a nice face, but I would think you got to see me right. from that. And I don't think you were gay walking then, for lack of a better term. I don't know. But like you, you, it's like you were just kind of... So occasionally you have like a tippy toe thing but this guy kind of stunned he was kind of looked stunned that I wouldn't give him my number and I think he like walked away and he was kind of puzzled like I can't fuck that guy my I- first assumption was it was a pickup only because what else could it be like yeah grift but what is this grift maybe like, he knows who I am he wants to put my phone number on reddit or something as a joke possibly I, don't know. I mean that, well, it's a dumb joke I don't care yeah. I really don't even care so getting dick pics like all right not bad yeah it's not bad people just call me and I keep them on the phone for an hour <laughs> They're like, this was a prank. I want to go. I'm like, no, listen, <laughs> there's a super soldier program. I don't know, man, but he was kind of good looking and I'm kind of mad. Dude, if I was that aggressive, I get laid all the time. Maybe that's just what that guy's about. Yeah. Maybe he's just like, he's got a, he's got a fucking dick full of cum. Yeah. And he just wants to fuck everybody. And I fucking yeah. screwed it up. But also maybe he wanted to come over to my hotel room and like rob me. Sure. You know, I don't it's a know. Weird, but it's a weird, like of what? Who what does do that have? work on though? I don't know. I don't. Yeah, I don't get it. Uh, how, like, does it? Would do certain dudes just go, "Hey, man, give me here." Yeah, here's my number. We can text about this book. If you, well, you pull out your phone, and he rips it out of your hand. Yeah, but he didn't even know I was gay. He didn't know anything about. No, like me. he pulls your phone out, like, and you, you, you're like, "Oh, I guess I'll text." And like, assuming that he'll like, you'll just not text him, but you won't be polite. And then he rips the phone out of your hand. Maybe I don't know what the deal is. I'm just kind of weirdly on guard when somebody, some stranger, gets in your face and starts asking you questions. Now, I respect his hustle. Sure. Whether he's snatching a phone or trying to kidnap a kid or trying to fuck, <laughs> try, you know, either way, I'm with you. I just don't want to be the victim of your scam. Right. But maybe it wasn't. Maybe he was just trying to fuck. I mean, I, if that's the case, he doesn't think we're fucking. Good point. You know, you should have stepped in. Yeah. Well, that's, that's my man. man. That's the man. <laughs> You're fucking him. You're fucking me. You're <laughs> fucking us both. <laughs> I want. He just gave me this deep look. Right. You, I think I think you're, you're crushing on this guy. Did you? He was kind of good look, but did you catch the way he looked at me? I'm like, it was he, weird. The whole exchange is very odd. And I'm like, kind of paranoid because we talk about weird shit on the show. I'm like, is, sure. he, is he the guy? Is this the guy that's coming to get us? Maybe he was casing us. Is yeah. this the guy? He's like, a, he's like one of those Michael Clayton guys. Is it a Billy Eilish fan that wants me dead? Oh shit! He's gonna torture and kill you. I don't know. Nice. I mean, I don't know, but now I feel weird about not giving him my number, not living dangerously. I mean. He did fuck up. I mean, you, you could have at least gotten laid or... What did you think? You said he wasn't that good looking now. Well, he, was, look, he wasn't your type. You typically like uh, more Twinks. slender guys. Yeah. So. Um, but no, he was he was fine looking. I mean, I think he was definitely... Uh, Imagine if you did that to a woman. What are you reading? <laughs> Listen, what are you reading? Was that a real David and Goliath story? Does David win? Does David win? You want to text me? <laughs> Why don't you text me the title of the book? They would like they would use like a uh, Patriot Act to like put me in Gitmo. <laughs> they would, she would use bear spray yeah. on you. Not even May. She'd go right <laughs> to bear spray. 
She just takes out a gun and just starts firing wildly. <laughs> she just starts firing. <laughs> what are you reading that? <laughs> this is why we can't give up the guns. Right. You would be on a poster. This is why you can't give up the guns. Because <laughs> this man asked what you were reading. Right. What are you reading? You want to text me? You want to start a book club? <laughs> Do you ever think what it would feel like to get eaten? Who is that, Dickens? <laughs> You're reading? Is that a tale of two cities? <laughs> Listen to me. Um, I don't know, man. Very strange, but I'll move on. It's another misconnection. 